Hey everyone and welcome to our YouTube channel. This video will be a Beehive newsletter tutorial. We're gonna dive right into how you can set up, design and launch your very own newsletter using Beehive. Essentially, we're going to go over how you can create your account with custom branding, such as the logo, colors and fonts, your first email created, previewed and scheduled, how you can run a live newsletter sign up page ready to collect subscribers and more. So if you would like to sign up for a free account and follow the instructions with me, go ahead and navigate to the link below this video. You will find a link that you can create your free account with just for convenience. And now let's get right into the video. So if you are unfamiliar, Beehive is an all-in-one newsletter platform built by former Morning Brew team members to help creators launch and monetize engaged audiences without any coding. It's got a drag and drop editor, built-in website builder, and powerful analytics that make it ideal for both beginners and experienced publishers. So again, to get started, click on the link in the description and start for free. You will be asked to provide your email address, your full name, and to choose a password. Once you hit create account, you will land on your new Beehive dashboard and your free tier will automatically launch with up to 2,500 subscribers. We're gonna talk about the plans a little bit later, but this is enough just to get your feet off the ground. Now, the second thing that we're talking about is uploading your brand assets to make your newsletter look like it's your own. For that, you wanna click on the settings or the gear icon at the bottom left corner and then branding. So this is the branding page. And then from here, you can upload your own logo as PNG or SFG. You can add a publication one line description and then choose a publication name for your newsletter. Choose up to three tags to describe your publication. This also helps with the SEO. And then onto the content access, you can actually choose whether to make your publication private, require subscriber approval, or completely remove Beehive's branding from your emails and website. That way you can fully customize the look and the feel to match your brand, but you would require upgrading your subscription. So once you're done with the basic branding, such as adding your logo and the other details, let's take a look at the main tabs. So onto your main dashboard, you can see an overview of your active subscribers, open rate and click rate, posts sent and impressions, and a subscriber growth graph. As soon as you land on this page, you get real-time insights, and now we can take a look to move on to writing content. And then we have the Start Writing tab, which is your content creation hub. You can draft emails here using your text blocks, image embeds, or the button or call to action elements. You can either start from a completely blank draft if you can't design everything yourself or want to, or you can start from the default template that takes a basic shape of the newsletter builder, or even start with one of these templates right here. Additionally, Beehive offers tools to expand your reach through a referral program, so you can make shareable links that reward subscribers, magic links that offer quick sign-up links, and pop-ups for capturing emails on your site. Now, if you have activated the paid newsletter options or joined the Beehive ad network, you can start earning revenue from your sponsors. And the way you can monetize your newsletter content is through the ads, boosts, or the paid subscriptions. So basically, you can start with the scale plan or even start a complete free trial. And then that way you can turn your audience into recurring revenue. You also keep 100% of the revenue, which is a great selling point when it comes to Beehive. Once again, if you want to test this plan out for completely free, go ahead and navigate to the link in the description. Click on it, create your account and start your free trial on the scale plan. Now on the audience tab, you can track and segment subscribers. So you can import lists as CSV uploads, create segments by tags, for example, VIP or trial. And then if you would like to take a deep dive into performance, you can go ahead and continue with the A to B testing for subject lines or 3D analytics showing subscriber cohorts over time. Next up, we have the design tab right here, which you can use the website builder on. This is what your newsletter design layout will look like, and you can edit everything here. You can add global colors for your branding elements, logo and identity, again, if you have not updated it, the fonts and the typography, radius and shadows, global navigation, subscriber widget, and all of that stuff. Now, if you don't know where to start or you're not the best at designing, you can click at an example site right here, and then it can give you kind of a template for you to start off of. So for example, if you really nail down the design, this is what you can start adding and experimenting with until you have your design to look like it. Now, when it comes to connecting your own domain, so when you have your own website, by default, your newsletter URL is something like yourname.beehive.com. So to use your own domain, you wanna to go to the settings and then domain, and then you can enter your own domain. Copy the provided CNAME record and add it into your DNS provider, such as GoDaddy or Cloudflare, etc. Verify it and then you can have your own custom domain that boosts trust and the brand recall. 
Next up, if you do have a list already of your subscribers, you can easily bring them in by clicking onto the audience and then subscribers and import. Now we can start writing our first email. So you want to hit to write and then you post. And then for the subject line, you want to ideally keep it under 50 characters. For the pre-header text, it could be about 100 characters max. And then you can start writing your emails with a simple structure. Such as for the body structure, you start with a greeting and then your enter paragraph. The main content, so you want to use bold for the subheadings within the email. If you would like to, you can head over to ChatGPT and make it design an entire email template for you to go off of. Don't forget to add your call to action somewhere at the bottom. And then in your footer, you can add two things. So you can add you are receiving this because you signed up at and then the unsubscribe link automatically included. Now a quick tip that I would give you is that if you want your subscribers to interact, you want to ask a question early on in the email and then preview your email both on desktop and mobile by clicking on the preview button and then you can schedule it for a date and time when your audience is most active. So when it comes to growing your audience, a solid plan uses three channels. The first one is social sharing as you can copy your referral link from grow and then referral program, post it on social media platforms like LinkedIn, such as just launched my newsletter, sign up here. And then you can use an image card preview to boost your clicks. We also have the pop-up forms. So into the grow, we have the pop-ups as you can enable a timed pop-up at 30 seconds or so on, and then offer a free resource such as a PDF guide in exchange for email. This is what most people would do. They would offer a free service for exchange of them to sign up with their email. If you would like to, you can also reach out to your peers with similar audiences and then offer a swap such as you promote their newsletter, they promote yours and etc. And once again, if you would like to make money out of this, for that, we've got two monetization options. So onto the monetize, you could offer paid subscriptions. So you can toggle that on if you have the right plan. You can set a price of your own newsletter. So for example, $5 per month or $50 per year. And then you can title it something like premium access. If you would like to track your performance, you want to head to the analyze section to see open rates by campaign, click heat maps on links, subscriber growth over time and the revenue trends if monetized. I highly recommend checking this weekly and adjusting content based on what resonates best. And finally, let's quickly talk about the pricing as you move forward. For that, we've got these plans starting at 1000 subscribers and the monthly price would be $49 per month on the scale plan. It gives you the paid subscriptions for monetization options. It also allows you to get referral program, 3D analytics, the survey forms and polls, teams up to three seats and more. You also get webhooks if you would like to connect and integrate this tool with other ones. The max plan at $109 per month would allow you to fully remove Beehive branding so you could have your own newsletter design, unlimited seats onto your team, up to 10 publications. You also get priority life support in case anything goes wrong. So of course you can start completely free with the free plan and then scale up as you gain more subscribers. So if you would like to give this tool a shot, go ahead and get started for completely free by navigating to the link below this video. Thanks so much for watching. Let us know if you have found this video to be helpful and informative to watch by giving us a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more content similar to this one.